Hey yo, your friendly neighborhood quarter guy here, and welcome back to my blind let's play of Adventures of Pip. On the last episode, we ventured further into the lava areas, and uh, I wasted too much time and lives on this one area that I didn't need to, but I didn't waste your time with that because I don't want to waste your time. Anyways, we got two more levels of the lava area to, to get through, so let's move. Alrighty, I can see some in there. I can see some in treasure up there, so. Better grab that. Foop. Hup. Alrighty. So. Alright. Wait for it. Hup. Hup. Good platforming, I mean, good jumping is needed there. I'm gonna screw it up a little there. Oh, I think I see something there. Hup. Treasure? Oh, crap. Okay, I need to be a little more careful to get this treasure. There we go. Boing! Boing! Evolution on the fly. Up. And there's some more treasure for my efforts. And there's the first checkpoint of the level. I wonder where the first villager is, though. Oh, this level's rising quick! Ah. Remember, that's always been a bit of a killjoy for me. There we go. Well, at least with games like Rogue Legacy, the permadeath mechanics are implemented well. But permadeath is a reason that uh, I really can't get. I really haven't gotten into most Fire Emblem games, but at least in Awakening, they at least make it optional. And there's a second villager right away, no trouble at all. I'll just float across this gap. Oh, hey! Hidden treasure chest! They just respond and then jump. Hup, hup! There we go! Oh, jeez, it's these wind enemies here. Boing! Checkpoint. All right, wait for that enemy to come back. Boing. 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 And boing. Wait. These enemies respawn? Oh, please tell me they respawn. Ah, crap. I screwed that up. There we go. Apparently greed makes fools of us all. So what I figure I'm gonna have to do is... Wait for that bitch room enemy to come back. Boop it, and then go for that treasure chest. Yep. There we go. That's how to not embarrass yourself. Hup. Just wait for the lava to come back up. And... Okay, gotta be careful there. Ah, there's our third villager! Alright, just wait for the thing to come back up. Just wait for the lava to come back up. And come back down. I'm gonna need my I'm gonna need my 16-bit form for this. Hup. 
Darn it! Alright. Just wait for that thing to come back down. Alright, I'm just gonna hang out here for a sec. Wait for that thing to come back. Just a waiting game. A waiting game. And yeah, it's a waiting game. So... There we go. And here's our bit stream. Boing! Oh, way to tease me like that, game! Just gonna hang out for a sec. And into the bitstream we go! Stage clear! Got a lot of pixels out of that, and all three villagers. Perfect! And with that, one more level of the Lava Fields remains. Lava 4-8. All right, let's just keep, let's just get rolling right away. All right, I know the drill with these enemies. If we want to keep them walking, we have to be in pixel form. No, no hidden secrets over there. Let's just boing our way over. Hup. Oh boy. A photoboo playing spanner in the works. Boing. Boing. Run across these things and boing. boop. 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 Boing. Ah! Hidden treasure chest! That always that always works well. Hello! Nothing hidden over there. Alright, let's just wait for that thing to respawn. Let it float down. Ah, here we go. Boing! Looks like there's our first villager of the level. Whoops. There, there, there we go. Oh! Mother Pfeiffer! Boop. Let's just... Be careful on the way across. Boing! 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 There we go. I think it'll be best to go if I, if I try to do this as, as a single pixel. Hidden area down there with another villager. Alrighty. Boing. 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 Alrighty. There's our checkpoint. Alright, wait for it. The right moment to go down. I think it only I think it stops uh rising and lowering at a certain point by the looks of things. Briefly abruptly stopped. Oh, it looks like there's our last villager of the level. Ooh. Alright. Work let's work our way up to get the villager. And that's the last villager in the lava world. Let's just wait for that. I'm gonna go back down. Now 
I think I'm gonna need to be in pixel form to get across this. And it looks like this is where the boss lies. Boing! Up across. And sure enough, it's, it's. I guess this isn't where the boss is quite. Oh, wait, there we go. Oh boy. Looks like we're gonna have to have some meteors. Well, I guess this is not where we fight the boss, but this is where the boss first appears. Wait, maybe there's more than one boss in this world. Oh! Somehow I don't somehow I don't think this is the boss of the lava area because there's no music playing. But for but okay. Lure out the lure out the uh meteors. Alright. Swipe its claw. There we go. Boing! One hit. Hup! And hup! Can't have that block interfering with us, can we? Alright. Lure out the meteors. Oh, I guess they doesn't necessarily relate to your position. Hup! Hup! Okay. Hup! Second hit! Further. There we go. Now we should be good there. Whoops. One Don't more hit. And. Down it goes. That was the boss. Wait. That is the last heart container, but. Strange. There was no music. Wow, you just won't die, will you? But that's a good thing. Hurry, follow me. Oh, wait, no. Don't tell me the queen... Please don't tell me the queen did what I think she did. All right, let's just get out of here. There's the bitstream. And the princess is here. I have a confession to make. And I'm not in love with you if that's if you thought where this was going. I mean, sure, you're kind of handsome in an occasionally one-by-one -one way, and you're nice and brave. I'm getting off topic. My confession is, the heroes you've met up to now on your journey, they weren't real. Oh, I've been using my magic, what little I have left, to project the illusion of great heroes to inspire you. I'm not even here right now. This is just a projection of me. I'm actually locked inside Queen Deresia's castle. Oh, good. For a minute, I thought you were dead. You must hate me now, right? I'd hate me if I were you. And you were someone else, I guess. Anyway, I thought I sh you, should show th you should know the truth. You have more bravery in one pixel than most have in their entire body. Which is good, because you're often just one pixel. Oh no, here she comes! Alright. Looks like we know what we gotta do now. Only one world remains now. It's time to venture into the... Dark Kingdom of Queen Derezia. Stage clear! And with all villagers to boot! Perfect! <laughs> and with that... Watch out, Queen Derezia. We're coming for you. That is, on the next episode of Adventures of Pip. 
Until then, this is the Quarter Guy, signing out. Oh.